family flex. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dan Q, and this is my review of Godzilla Huntley's family vlog, episode 13. This is a test of the uh, internet in our hotel. During the course of this week's episode, Godzilla and her friend Zara go to America. We're leaving to go to America. I'm sure that no heads were turned when Godzilla crept into the bathroom of the aeroplane carrying a small black beeping box. That would be the Cathedral Church of St John the Divine, the largest Anglican church anywhere in the world, but clearly you didn't read the plaque on your way in. Would you like to add anything? Aye. 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 Godzilla has her own try at an educational piece teaching us about the Whispering Chamber in Grand Central Station. This is the whispering tunnel, a whispering wall, whatever you're going to call it. This allows her and Zara to gossip from a distance of 30 feet. It's a bit louder, Zara. Hello. Hello. I can only see this as an improvement. If I had to talk to Zara, I'd want to be 30 feet away too. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Later, Godzilla and Zara take a helicopter tour of New York, which looks f***ing awesome. Beer Pong is played. Beer Pong is a curiously American invention, but Godzilla and Zara seem to take to it quite well. Come on, you have to polish it off. Let's do this. <laughs> if, like me, you're drinking from a bottle, you'll probably find Beer Pong is quite difficult. Woo! Godzilla and Zara enjoy TGI Fridays on a Thursday. What? TGA Fridays on a Thursday? Wednesday? So it's when's Thursday. 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 No, Thursday. Godzilla didn't seem sure for a bit there. Perhaps they had more to drink at the beer pong tournament than they thought. Godzilla decided that she wasn't up for a cycle around the city. They didn't want to go to a bacon roll. <laughs> a bacon roll in the park. I can't think why. They travel to the Empire State Building, then the real drinking begins. We're treated to a series of photographs showing some of the other things that Godzilla and Zara got up to. But hang on, this is all Godzilla and Zara. What's Sarah been up to all this time? During my recent trip to Preston, I was issued with sort of a press pack telling me the appropriate language that I should be using when describing certain aspects of the family's behaviour. For example, in a previous episode, I referred to Richard, the fellow with the excessive beard, as being Sarah's boyfriend. Uh, I've been told that the correct term to use is fuck buddy. If we don't call Richard a fuck buddy, then how are we to differentiate between him and Sarah's other little bit on the side, this chap? I think that he must be made of Lego or something. I guess that he's dressed as a captain because he's in charge of a lot of seamen? In any case, I certainly wouldn't want to embarrass Sarah by using the wrong language. Further in the acceptable words list, I've been told that I'm no longer allowed to refer to Zara as <laughs> We get to see a few photos from Sarah's week. Lots of skimpy underwear and a rubber duck. A great thing about this episode is that it was a little bit like watching somebody's home movies of their holiday, but it had been cut down to only a few minutes, so it didn't have to be suffered for very long. Altogether, I give this episode 19 caramel wafers. Mm. Wait a minute. 
we didn't see anything from Godzilla's mother this week. It turns out that Godzilla's mother filmed some footage for the vlog, but Godzilla didn't include it. You can find it here.